Out of the Reformation of the 1500s came what we call the five solas or sole. But what do they mean? Simple men of God, Daniel. But now I want to look at something a little different. Last week has been rough on the news. The great thing about this is I can edit out stuff that's also wrong. Let's talk about it. The Reformation started as a call to return to a simple faith not dogged down by man-made or superfluous rules and dogmas. This is not the time for a debate about Catholic versus Protestant and denominational separation. It does lead to our first sola, sola scriptura, scripture alone. Basically, this means that all of our traditions and understanding about God Jesus and humanity should be based on what the Bible says about God, Jesus, and humanity. There is value in traditions, the various councils and books or teachings, but they must conform to what Scripture as a whole teaches. This includes the matter of salvation, covered in the next sole, Sola gratia, sola fide, solus Christus, soli deo gloria. That means by grace alone, through faith alone, in Christ alone, to the glory of God alone. This was summarized by Paul in Ephesians chapter 2 when he said, <clears throat> But God, being rich in mercy, because of the great love with which he loved us, even when we were dead in our trespasses, made us alive together with Christ. By grace you have been saved, and raised us up with him, and seated us with him in the heavenly places in Christ Jesus, so that in the coming ages he might show the immeasurable riches of his grace in kindness toward us in Christ Jesus. For by grace you have been saved through faith, and this is not your own doing. It is the gift of God, not a result of works, so that no one may boast. And that was verses 4 through 9 in the English Standard Version. Now, we still need to confess our sins, primarily to God, but also to each other. See James 5, 16. We still do works, but as an act of obedience and love for the one who saves us. See 2 Corinthians 5, 14 through 15. But it is only through Christ, to the glory of the Father, as revealed in Scripture, that we are saved. Now, this is only a brief overview. We can continue to discuss this in the comments or through email at together at a simple man of God dot com, or even on our Facebook page, A Simple Man of God. I'm sure there's going to be more videos and articles that I'll make discussing this. We'll see. Otherwise, this has been Give Me Five. And I think I did this in less than five minutes. Yeah, it's still lame. Anyway, I love you. Bye.